y'all, it's Kadisha. I'm back with another video. So I'm actually trying to do portrait. No. Yeah, is this portrait mode? Let's get, I don't know whichever the one the one. But uh, I just wanted to probably, I guess it's kind of like a part two of someone is always watching. And I sometimes really forget that, I think, because we oftentimes just live our life for us. And I say this when, when I say live our life for us, not really, because of course we do things so other people can see it uh but i went on a walk today which i go on a walk with my clients all the time and i was talking to one of the neighbors and so they were asking me on my opinion of something and they was like oh did you go to school in arkansas and i'm like no 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 they were like oh so you know where you went to school was you know back in arkansas and I'm just like, I, the most I've ever said to this person is kind of like a high and by type of thing. I've never said anything to them. And not to say that they're watching me specifically, but it's just like they're watching my car. Because I have like this license plate on my car that has Arkansas. And it actually, I'm not saying, I don't even know if it has Arkansas on there specifically. But it's just like the, um, it's just like the symbol of the Razorback. And I'm just like... After I was thinking for a minute, I was like, how did that person know that? But it goes back to, like I said, people are watching you. And so this is something that I'm just trying to be more aware of and trying to be intentional about how I act. Not to say put on a facade, because of course, if you're doing stuff in the dark, it's going to come out to the light. So it's just like really being intentional with the way you treat people, the way you're interacting with the environment or whatever the case may be because someone is watching the way you live your life and this is not for you to say well i'm not living my life for other people type of thing but it's just more so of what are you trying to represent so if you're trying to represent something in particular you can't go out living your life any kind of way and then get mad when people judge you on that. And then we all say, you know, nobody can judge me but God. But that, of course, yeah, only, and I heard this from another guy. He's like, yeah, only God can put you into heaven or hell. But people will judge your character the way you act. And that's just human nature. We're, we all do that. Like if someone, if I see someone steal something, if I see them again, what I'm going to, I'm like, okay, let me not leave myself around them because they were stealing. They've been stealing before or, you know, don't invite them to my house because they're stealing. And you may call that judging, but it's just like, no, that's smart because you a thief. And so that just goes back into if you don't want people to think a certain thing about you, then be intentional with the way that you live your life. And like I said, this is more so, these videos are for me to be a reminder of me because I'm now looking for an outfit to wear to out to dinner. And I just have all these creative ideas of what I want to wear. And I'm just thinking like, Lord, does that represent you? And sometimes we can be more holy than thou. And not to say you can't have a fashion statement when you're a Christian, but it is a way that you should dress if you want to represent god that's your own thing if you don't that's fine but as for me it made me go back and really think like this is represent you lord because that is my goal is to make sure i'm representing the lord and even though i fall short daily i still want to perfect the areas in which i can and so if that is in the way that i dress okay let me work on that area and i think we forget those things and so this is just a reminder to be intentional about what you're doing because everybody's watching like somebody is watching <laughs> and they are judging you accordingly and it may be a false judgment so what but it's just like don't let your good be evil spoken of because of the way you're living your life so thank you so much for watching this video. Like I always say, say I come be okay, Katie's been in otros. Until next time, bye.